What's up you guys? It's Jono! Welcome to another episode of my Pokemon Legends Arceus request series. Today we're on request number 54, serving up swap snacks. You can unlock this request after you get the rideable Pokemon Basque Legion. So if you haven't got that rideable Pokemon yet, then you may want to wait because you won't be able to get it just yet. And you also need to talk to Bon at the candy store in front of the Galaxy Hall in Jubilee Village. Talk to him one time and then after you talk to him that first time, you should see the request icon above his head. You don't need to buy anything from him, you just have to talk to him at least one time and you'll go through a little experience. And after that, you should see the request and if not, then you haven't progressed the story enough. So go ahead and progress the story to make sure you get that done. Alright you guys, now Bon is looking for three key ingredients. They're really not hard to find whatsoever. He needs a soot foot root, a springy mushroom, and he also needs a hoppo berry. Hopefully you've got these items in your inventory. You can go ahead and check your item storage and see if you've got those items. I always have a pretty good supply of items on hand because I'm always grabbing items as I see them out in the field. I pick up pretty much everything that I see. If you're looking for a hoppo berry, you can find them on a green berry tree that has yellow berries on the tree. So if you're looking around, go to Crimson Myrlands and you can find one of those trees pretty close to the main camp. You're just looking for a dark green tree with the bright yellow berries on it. You can also find the springy mushroom in Obsidian Fieldlands. You can also find the Sootfoot Root in Alabaster Icelands, but you may not be to Alabaster Icelands just yet. You can also find it in Crimson Myrlands as well. They're really not too hard to find, and I don't recommend to go and search for those items at all. I would recommend to go over here to the Ingredients Item Guy and make sure that you just buy those crafting materials. It's really not hard to buy these crafting materials. He should have them available for you. You can see there's Springy Mushrooms. If you're far enough to get this request, then you definitely can get the Springy Mushrooms from from him and you should be able to get the soot foot root as well because it becomes available once you get to the cobalt coastlands so you should be able to get both of those items and you may be able to get the hoppo berry from the ginkgo guild if you don't have any so i would recommend to check the ginkgo guild salesperson as well just in case you're looking for that hoppo berry but if not you're gonna have to head over to the crimson Myrlands. but yeah make sure you try and buy all these in jubilee village and you should be able to get through this really quickly now once you get done he will make for you the swap snack and you'll also get the recipe for the swap snack as well the swap snack is just one of those items that help you in battles it'll swap your attack and your defense stats it's pretty useful there's items that do this in this game but in other games there are moves that do it as well i'm not even sure if there is a move in this game that can do the swap but anyway, you can get the item and you can use it on any Pokemon, whether or not they can learn that move. So it is kind of a useful item. Given that there's no PvP battling in this game, it's not like the best use item. I mean, I guess if you're in a tough battle near the end of the game or something. But anyway, you guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope it was helpful for you. And this is one of those recipe requests. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Thank you to all of my amazing subscribers. And peace.